It's about to get weird. I'm Paula Froelich. Take a journey with me to explore the unknown and discover the unexpected. This is Abroad Abroad. The adventure starts now. I always wanted to visit Greenland. Dog sleds, polar bears, the northern lights, you know, the usual. But on my second day in Greenland, my romantic visions were squashed due to a massive snowstorm. There my crew and I were snowed in, in Nuuk. I know I'm in Greenland for work, but all work and no play makes Paula a dull, dull girl. So I decided to try and make some friends. There were three people on Tinder. <laughs> Making friends in Greenland. Three guys on Tinder. All right, so I found one potential friend. I could make him hang, right? Hey, I'm shooting a travel show in Nuuk. And we are snowed in. Any interest in being on camera, talking about what it's like to date in Nook? Dinner on me. <laughs> Unfortunately, my request went unanswered. So I moved to social media for inspiration. And of course, the sadistic Twitterverse all wanted me to venture outside into Snowmageddon, starting with making a snow angel, to building my own snow cave, to instigating a random snowball fight with strangers. And finally, back indoors for an impromptu dance party and karaoke. Of course, due to music licensing, I had to mime my karaoke. Any guesses? Two days later, I had exhausted all social media ideas. And no joke, the snow was still going. Everyone was complaining about snowmageddon in New York and Boston this winter. And this is snowmageddon. It's a complete blackout. This is running off a generator. And we're stuck here for about a week. Fun fact. And there it was, cabin fever. A claustrophobic reaction when one is stuck inside for an extended period of time, possibly resulting in hallucinations. Hey, guess what? It's still snowing outside. Shocking. Oh, come on. We're gonna get out of here eventually. It's all right. Apparently, this is your new home. Forever. And hug myself. And a hug myself. Look, there's no one here. Eventually, the snow did stop and the sun came out, and oh, it was worth the wait. You know, some places are like people. Some shine and some don't. And I'd say Greenland has something about it that even through a snowstorm, it has shining. On the next episode of Abroad Abroad, I learn how to make my favorite beverage, Greenland style.